Alrighty, we are back to Persona 4. Ugh. It's in between us and Lightning Returns, and while I do like Lightning Returns somewhat, I would play um, Persona. Juggling two Persona games is not as... wasn't a smart idea. Because of that, I gotta focus on t both games and make sure I don't screw up in either one. The good thing is I'm actually getting somewhere in Persona 3, so that's something. It took me a while, but I got somewhere. Alright. Now, as much as I want to hang out with the girls today, if Kanji's willing to hang out with me, I'm willing to hang out with him. Although, I just feel sad that I had to start his social link so late in the game, though. Like, I do, I do actually, I honestly do feel really bad that I had to start Kanji's social link this late. I, I do feel bad. Like, I do really feel bad, because, like, I could have done it way earlier and screwed up badly. <laughs> Man, I'm starving for some Chinese. But if I eat then, if I eat and then go home, I can't finish mom's food. She served so much, she think I have five brothers. She's trying to make my stomach burst. Aren't you Kanji Tatsumi? What are you doing here? Can't you tell? Hey, you're a cop. What do you mean, what am I doing? Just what I said. There's been quite a commotion around here lately. Well, maybe if you did your job, things get quieter, huh? You need to fix that attitude. Oh well, just don't pull anything. Got it. I didn't. <sighs> Ugh, I'm gonna eat somewhere else. Asshole. The cops are always that, always like that. As soon as you spot me, it's like, what are you doing? They're like, you look suspicious and all of that BS. Man, I'm used to it. Sorry for getting you mixed up in this, senpai. I know she's a troublemaker for you and for mom. She's always apologizing for me. She's been sprouting more and more white hairs. Yeah, huh? Kanji is not any earnestly. Filial piety, right? I really don't know what to do. Or so I thought. I'm gonna use this power I got to make this town peaceful. I've been causing nothing but trouble, but now I can finally return the favor. So let's get let's get to it, senpai. You can feel Kanji's enthusiasm. You feel like you understand Kanji even more. Rank 2 Kanji talk to me. Hey, Chef, is the food ready yet? Huh? You ordered something, Kanchan? I told you to call me Kanchan, and I did order liver, leek, stir fry, and pot stickers. I'm gonna tear your store apart so fast you won't have the time to file for insurance. Oh, uh, well. I'm gonna tear apart, rebuild it twice as good. I I'm gonna renovate your ass. Sounds good to me. Alright, let's go. I'm gonna renovate your ass. Keep it cool, Kanji. Oh, welcome back. I went shopping today. His fridge is full of food. All right. Uh. Hey, perfect time. What's up? Are you doing anything after school? Want to grab something to eat? Will you spend the day with Yosuke? And yeah, I'll start later. Hmm. I don't know what I want to do after school. Sorry about that, guys. Give me a second. Hope you enjoy all joy of school trip. 
Don't you just feel a bit more mature now you visit an urban area like that? Oh, by the way, that cute berry that Kaisa Kun had on the trip. Where'd you get that? I get so tinted by animals with such a unique design. Speaking of bears, some species feet. Okay, oh god. Oh boy. My knowledge has went up again. Yay! Gotta be doing something. Hmm. Much I like Ayane, I haven't hung out with Yosuke in a long ass time. Hey, look at that madness. <laughs> Alright, Yosuke, let's hang out, brother. Junette's food court. You came here with Yosuke for a quick bite to eat. So, what you gonna eat today? Oh god. Hey, Hanamura. What is it today? How come Kazumi can take the day off and we can't? Huh? We told you before, we can't work weekends. So when we refused, they said we were gonna fire they said they were gonna fire us. I don't get this. Hey, I talked to the manager. Senpai, have you been taking absences without leave to lately? I, I just forgot to come. Besides, that's not the point. What are you gonna do about this? I have a date that day. How come you're favoring Kazumi, huh? You were just like that with Saki, too. Huh? Don't try to hide it. We all know. You liked Saki and treated her special. <clears throat> I don't think Saki-senpai has anything to do with this subject. Yeah, it does. You told the other workers to take it easy on Saki, did you? You think you could do anything just because you're the manager's son? So is Kazumi and now Saki's dead? Don't even bother. She has a boyfriend. Don't you get it? Saki didn't like you. We all heard from her. She may have acted that way, but... They started to badmouth Saki Senpai. Yeah, shut the hell up, you freaking pack of harpies. What? Who are you? You shut up. You're the one to just shut up. What do you know about Saki Senpai? She didn't do half-assed things like you. She looked lazy, but she worked hard. She talked bad, but she was good inside. So she hated me. I knew that. She's not here anymore. I'm left behind. So just leave me alone. What the heck? Let's go. <clears throat> Damn it. I just blurted out a bunch of crap, huh? No, I'm even more confused than ever. Just has a self mocking smirk on his face. Damn it. Damn, another prophetic display from Yosuke, huh? Thanks. Thanks, though. Can you say that stuff to them? Made me happy. Yosuke smiles sheepishly. I feel your relationship with Yosuke has grown deeper. <sighs> I don't want to. I really don't want to, but I'll go talk with Dad. At this rate, those two are gonna quit. And I should tell him and apologize. I don't know. What do I want to do? I don't get it, even though it's my own future. Sorry, but I'll see you later, Kaizo. Good evening, and welcome to Nightline's special Night Watch Report. A suspect in the murders in Inaba was safely arrested recently. But what few people know is that the mastermind who brought him to justice was a high school detective. Tonight's report will focus on this detective prince, Naoto Shirogane, whose handsome looks are sweeping the nation. Thanks for being on the show. No, no. The pleasure is all mine. Naoto's on TV. Oh, his uniform is the same as yours. First, congratulations to you and the police for your recent arrest of the culprit. It was well known that there were a lot of mysteries surrounding this case, and you did a great job clearing them up. I'd hesitate to say that the matter is cleared up as such. It's true that our suspect was behind Mr. Moraoka's unfortunate death, but when I cast my eye over the case as a whole, I detect a few things that 
seem out of place. Oh? Like what? Unfortunately, I cannot divulge details at this time. But this matter claimed the lives of three people. Hence, I believe even the smallest inconsistency must be investigated. I... I see. I have to say, this is a surprise in light of the police's official statement. Now for our next segment, the Detective Prince's true identity, where Nato-kun tells us a little bit about himself. Amazingly, the Detective Prince has solved a whopping 24 cases. 16 of them were... There's a detective at your school? When I'm older, I'm gonna go to your school, too. Aww. Bree's evening passes by. I want to see Teenage Nana go. That'd be sweet. All right, guys. Yo. Hey, did you see the show on TV last night? Now Takun was on. The thing about the detective prince solving the case? Come on, we're the ones who actually caught the killer. But the police were the ones who identified the suspect, and he was cooperating with them on it, right? So it's true that he helped solve the case. I'm kind of surprised, though. I didn't think he was the type to go after the spotlight like that. Good morning. Oh. I've been waiting for you all. There's something I needed to discuss with you regarding the case. Well, balls. Discuss? Dude, we'll be late if we talk too long. Hey, where's your uniform? Could you please indulge my current theory on the matter? What is it? First, as regards commonalities between the victims, all of them were kidnapped before they were murdered. The victims were all locals who had been the focus of recent media attention, becoming suddenly well-known. That is the most likely scenario. I don't believe there's anything intrinsically unique about the victims themselves. Haven't you all come to the same conclusion? I played the fifth. Then allow me to state my point. Will you admit that a number of you fit these identical circumstances? Uh, he's getting too close. There was a long interval between the second and third deaths in this case. But after I applied the aforementioned criteria, I discovered several similar disappearances had taken place. <clears throat> Yukiko Amagi, Kanji Tatsumi, Risei Kujikawa. All of you disappeared shortly after being shown on TV. Either you escaped death somehow, or you faked your own disappearances in order to divert attention from yourselves. Since some of you had ties to the victims, there came a point where I suspected one of you must be the culprit. Oh, hell. You thought one of us was the killer? You can't be serious. I know, damn. This was a prior theory, since discarded. Okay, cool. Putting together everything I've learned until this moment, I believe exactly the opposite. You aren't the culprits. You may, in fact, be the only ones with the means to pursue the true perpetrator. Oh, goddamn. Seen as a joining of forces between the rescued, everything falls into place. Damn, this is good. This is all speculation. <laughs> yeah, speculation. Keep it that way. It is, in fact, a flaw in the theory. It doesn't account for the third incident, Mr. Moraoka's murder. He has never been broadcast on television, and neither did he ever disappear. We must also consider the condition of his corpse. The first two victims are still listed with an unknown cause of death. But Mr. Moraoka died of an easily identifiable blunt force trauma to the occipital cranium. The police have not satisfactorily resolved this discrepancy, yet they are desperate to close the case. Further action will be necessary to obtain some sort of decisive evidence. Further action? What do you mean? Yeah. Well, whatever the outcome, the evidence should come to light. You said something interesting to me not long ago. Hey, where are you going? This is not a game for me, either. Now, Jokun? I think we screwed up there, guys. I think we screwed up. Oh, God, Naoto didn't come to school. Is he dead? 
Is he dead? I'm sure dead, because I'm done playing for tonight. I was going to do another episode, though I doubt it. I don't know. That guy, I can't figure nothing else to play. Hmm. You know what? Yeah, why not? I guess I'll end this episode and start a new one. Or should I? I don't even know. But I'm, I'm going to end it right here, so see you later, guys.